Disney Princess Tangled. Rapunzel finds a friend. Long before Rapunzel knew she was a princess, she was a lonely little girl. Mother Gotho often left Rapunzel for days, and the only creatures that crossed her path were butterflies, bees, and the occasional bird. Bees do not like hooks. Butterflies are notoriously skittish. And no matter how many seeds Rapunzel gave them, the birds never stuck around very long. Since friends were scarce, Rapunzel did the next best thing. She filled each day with a new activity. She tried painting, but her finished artwork didn't look as good as what she had imagined. Next, she tried baking, but her cake came out burned and black. <laughs> Finally, Rapunzel tried gardening, but her seeds didn't sprout. Worst day ever, said Rapunzel. I can't paint, I can't bake, and I can't even... I can't grow one even strawberry. Oh, Lord, I said that wrong. Worst day ever, said Rapunzel. I can't paint, I can't bake, and I can't grow even one strawberry. There we go. Suddenly, Rapunzel noticed a strange pattern in the dirt. Looking closer, she realized it was footprints. Let's see where else they show up, she said. A few hours later, she found the same prince in her paint. When the prince appeared in her flower, Rapunzel knew something was up. This is a mystery, she said. From then on, whenever Rapunzel created art, she spilled a little paint. <coughs> Excuse me. Whenever she baked, she scattered a little flour. Whenever she gardened, she sprinkled a little dirt. She wanted to see if the prince would reappear, and they always did. Though Rapunzel did, still didn't know who was making the prince, she spent a lot of time practicing her hobbies. That's how she became very good at painting, baking, and gardening. One day, as she was picking berries, Rapunzel noticed an odd-shaped berry among the others. As she reached for the berry, it changed color. Before her was a small, green ch 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 chameleon. Chameleon. <laughs> <laughs> chameleon <laughs> so you're the one who's been leaving <laughs> is that chameleon so you're the one who's been leaving the little prince said rapunzel the chameleon seemed to nod my name is rapunzel said the little girl i'll call you pascal would you like some cake rapunzel learned that pascal never said no to cake and pascal learned that rapunzel was the best friend a chameleon could ever ask for the end